speech is the story of mountain climbing. Uh, with so many big and famous mountains, uh, Taiwan truly is a paradise for mountain climbers. Uh, it's no doubt that mountain climbing is a very good exercise and a very popular in Taiwan. Uh, I like <coughs> many kinds of sports, but uh, mountain climbing is never one of them. Uh, because I think mountain climbing is a little too monotonous. It's just a repeat, simple and uh, mechanical move motions over and over again, like uh, jogging and uh, swimming. Uh, so, in a word, I don't like mountain climbing. But uh, in my life, I was partly forced to do one. I work, I work at the uh, Central Weather Bureau, Zhongyang Qijiang, which has a very famous weather station at the north peak of Mount Jie, uh, the Yishan Weather Station. Um, we always call Yishan Weather Station the highest uh, administration of ROC, Zhongyang Mingguo Zui Gao Xin Ren Qi Guan. Of course, uh, not, not this level, but this height. And uh, many of my colleagues uh, are proud of having visited the uh, Yishan Weather Station and uh, conquer Mountain Jet because all we regard Yishan Weather Station as our spiritual symbol. And uh, many of my co-workers uh, praised me for my performance in sports, but sometimes they didn't forget to tease me of have no guts to climb up the mountain. And uh, in 2002, at the age of 43, I finally couldn't not uh, tolerate this kind of humiliation and uh, decided to climb up the mountain. I had full confidence in my strength, so I did little preparation for my climbing. Uh, but uh, when I begin my climbing, I what I I realized that I was totally wrong uh, because I overestimated over estimated my ability and uh, underestimated the majesty of the mountain uh, because the path to my destination is much more winding and uh, steeper than I expect than I expected. And so, uh, I begin to feel sour in my legs, uh, even half an hour after my climbing, and uh, eventually, every step became harder and harder for me. But in spite of uh, great fatigue, I still try my effort to continue you know, my climbing because I knew if I quit, I will no face to go back to my company and uh, my co-worker will teach me to die. <laughs> uh, so uh, after nine hours of climbing, I finally reached the Yishan weather station in extreme exhaustion. Uh, when I feel relaxed, and the uh, thought of taking a rest, things were even worse because I began having serious headache and a vomit, some symptom of so-called mountain sickness. And uh, the symptom persisted and uh, prevented me from sleeping all night long. It was really the most terrible night in my life. Uh, fortunately, uh, the symptom died away little by little in the next morning, and uh, I regained my strength. Uh, the second, second day of my journey was better, and I success, successfully stood, stood at the top of Taiwan. Uh, when I reached the peak, the first thing I do, I, the first thing I did is not 
busy in taking pictures, but calling my friend to tell that you can tease me anymore. <laughs> uh, with so many pioneers and uh, painful experience, uh, I told my companions that this is my first uh, mountain climbing and uh, the last one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but tell you the truth, I have been there two more times after work. But uh, she on me, I went there by helicopter, not on foot. <laughs> <laughs> Some members of my club are planning to go to Yushan in June. Uh, I sincerely wish you have a nice trip. The <laughs> 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 uh, most important thing is just uh, coming out. <laughs> 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 <laughs>